and my brothers and sisters in Christ. <clears throat> I wanted to share with you a dream that I had a few days ago. And I was just waiting to get more understanding before I actually put it out. All right. In this dream, I was indoors and I was with a friend of mine, in which in reality, I don't know this person. But in the dream, it was made known that she was my friend. And in front of us was a crowd of people in which we were walking towards. I seen that my friend had a few things, had um, a few things in her hands. And she was walking ahead of me to join the crowd. And I was still um, trying to catch up. As she was walking ahead of me and I was still uh, trying to catch up, I started choking in this dream. So while I was choking, I placed both my hands over my neck. as a symbolic sign that I needed help. I looked to my friend and she seen that I was choking. But what startled me is she refused to place her belongings down to help me. So with that, I looked at the crowd to see if anyone within that crowd was willing to help. No one wanted to help. So I walked away from them. And out of the midst of the crowd, I seen a woman coming out towards me. And she grabbed me from behind, in which I was relieved. And I said, I'm happy. I was saying to myself that I was happy that someone was willing to come to help me. In this dream, she was given the name Protestant. I remember that. And it stuck with me when I woke up. She came from behind. And what I thought is, I thought she was going to do the Heimlich. <clears throat> to get whatever object that was in my throat out. But that wasn't the case. It's like she was passively helping me. And then out of nowhere, while I was still choking, and this what shocked me the most when I woke up, is this woman started fondling me, started caressing me, started to kiss on my neck. And I remember in this dream, while I was still choking, I was saying, what the heck is going on? Later on, before the dream ended, she placed her finger in my neck, in my throat, seeking to scoop whatever that was lodged in my throat out. Then the dream ended. I didn't put the dream out because I did not understand it. All I remember is when I woke up, the woman's name was Protestant. It was clearly made known in this dream. Because when I woke up, I kept seeing over and over what I remembered in my dream. Protestant. Protestant. So I waited a while. Understanding was given. This woman represented a church, a denomination, coming out of churches, which was that crowd of people in front of us. They all seen that I was choking on something, but they refused to help me to get it out. And with them refusing to help me to get it out, I would have died. And no one would have cared. 
So out of that crowd, out of that church, the denomination Protestant came out. Made it seem like by them coming out to help me or by her coming out to help me, it made it seem like she was assisting me. It made it seem like she was going to be that hero to save me. But that was not her mindset. That was not her true mindset. But she was very passive. She was playing around. Wanted to show the world that yes, we will help. But in all reality, she didn't want to help. Instead, in this dream while she was fondling me and caressing me, It's showing that she was wicked. Evil. Sought her gain. And it wasn't until when the dream ended that then she placed her finger in my uh, throat seeking to scoop out whatever that I was choking on. But them that have understanding, understand. What I was given is the last days, church, that stood out in this dream. And I realized, days after the dream, how the church itself is seeking to unite. Keep your eyes open for something like that. In the spirit. Keep your eyes open for something like that. In the spirit. Where a church will seem like they're seeking to help the rest of the body or the rest of the world. But inwardly, they have their own agenda, their own mindset. For them that follow in this video and you may be Protestant and um, belong to that de denomination be not offended if this does not uh, if this does not describe your inner motive I'm just going over a dream that I have For them who the Lord gives interpretations of dreams, you may know more in depth than I do. This is why right after the dream, I didn't want to put it out because I did not know. I didn't understand. The only thing I knew in the dream is that that woman was given the name Protestant. And I waited and I kept pondering on a dream and I waited and I kept pondering on a dream and I waited. My understanding was finally given. So that's the only reason I'm putting this dream out today. Y'all take care.